Hey girls, did you miss me? I actually have a video this time. Well, sort of. It's going to be really short because it's really dark outside because it's like 11 at night and cold and snowy and I'm not going to go outside for an adventure right now. And my little brother was going to help me with the song, but um, because he has school tomorrow, he can't. He's in bed. But I have hot mulled cider in my Wisconsin mug. See, it has a mouse because Wisconsin is the dairy state. And so cheese and mice eat cheese, supposedly. I know it's backwards. For some reason, this webcam thingy does that. So I just realized that I can see like reflections of the screen in my glasses. It's odd. Whatever. Happy Sunday! To talk about Deathly Hallows this video, I think. I actually really, really liked it. I wasn't as bothered as a lot of people were at the prospect of, you know, Harry Potter and the extended camping trip. It really didn't bother me. Like, I thought most of it was somewhat necessary, at least. I thought it was interesting how kind of the evil of the Horcruxes could leech out and make people like Ron into two old douchebags. It spawned a lot of really good Wizard Rock songs, like practically all of the Hermione Cruikshanks experiences EP Penelope, spaced off of Deathly Hallows. I'm really excited for the movie of Deathly Hallows to come out, I think. Even though, yeah, they'll probably butcher it, I have learned in my mind to separate the books and the movies because otherwise there is no way, no way that I'll be able to enjoy the movies because they have to take stuff out. They have to, to make it into a movie. It's not just, like, sp smushing it into a two-hour long movie, but just to make it kind of watchable. One part that I really liked was about how we got to learn so much more about Snape. Like, I thought... The saddest part of the movie was going through his memories at the end. I don't do love or romance in real life, but I thought it was so sad and tragic how, like, he was so in love with Lily Potter, Lily Evans then, obviously, and then she went and died, and everybody keeps screwing him over. There was Voldemort, and there was Dumbledore, and Dumbledore was a complete get to him. And those of you who have read my essay that I wrote for seminar have kind of seen my views on that. I really liked learning more about Dumbledore and his family. Again, I thought he had a tragic story too, like Ariana. That was so sad. And I mean, obviously it wasn't just like a beating that the Muggle kids did to her because that wouldn't have messed her up as much as she was. I thought it was really interesting how, like, everybody famous in Harry Potter ends up living at one time or another in Godric's Hollow. I thought that was really cool. I'm not very far in your Christmas presents yet. This is literally how far I am. This is Brooks. You can see a little bit of embroidery there. <laughs> well, not embroidery, but knots, which will become a friendship bracelet. They're gonna look like... Hold on. And somewhat like that when they're done, only instead of saying rock stock, they will say, well, you'll see that later, if I ever finish them. But that's roughly what they'll look like. They'll probably be getting those this summer or something, assuming I get to actually do them. Next week's video, next week Sunday, I am going to New York, so for most of the day I'll be on a plane, and then I'll be at a musical. Hopefully the hotel will have internet, but I'm not sure, so I don't know if I'll be able to make a video or not.
Maybe I can take Potter in Your Pants on an adventure in New York. That'd be cool. Only that might be weird to be like filming on the street or something. I don't know. We'll see. I still have my Rockstock bracelet on. It says Rockstock, but maybe you can't. Oh, there. Yeah, it's falling apart at the moment. But I refuse to take it off. Last time I didn't take mine off for like seven months and then I had to. It's still up in my room. I found it yesterday. It's like all twisted up and kind of grungy. But that's okay. At least it's clean because it goes in the shower with me. Have a nice winter holiday if you celebrate anything. Um, and I'll see you maybe next week or the week after or some time if you're Potter in Your Pants Girl and I'll see you on the thread and on Facebook. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the Rockstock videos that I posted. Hopefully I'll be posting the rest, but I'm lazy, so that's maybe. But I have like 20 or 30 of them.